Welcome to Stump the Scientist. Our question today comes from Zach Armstrong. His eight-year-old daughter Natalie wants to know why gravity can hold a human down, but not completely. Okay, we'll address that question from Natalie. Of course, gravity holds everything down on Earth, not just humans. And we're very familiar with what happens when we drop something. Uh, if we take an object and we throw it up, it takes a little while for it to come down because it takes a while for gravity to slow it down and then pull it back. And if we throw it up faster and harder, it takes a little longer for gravity to slow it down and bring it back to Earth. And so when Natalie asks, but not completely for holding humans down, she's probably referring to the fact that if we throw something up, a human or another object, fast enough, it will never come back down. And that's reasonable for a reason besides the fact that we're throwing it very high, as the object gets very high from the center of the Earth, the gravity actually gets less. So when you combine the fact that if we throw it very fast and very hard with the fact that the gravity is getting less, it's not too surprising that it might not come back to Earth. And it turns out that that's true. And it turns out that the velocity that we have to throw something up so that it will never return has a particular name, it's called escape velocity. And it's a very fast amount, it's a very fast number, very high number, it's 25,000 miles per hour. And that explains, of course, why we don't see this happen very often. But we do see it happen, of course, with our rockets. We can take our rockets and we can put satellites, humans, and other objects away from Earth in such a way that they never come back. Now, escape velocity depends on the amount of gravity, so it's 25,000 miles per hour on Earth, but it's a lesser amount on the Moon, because gravity is less on the Moon, or if you went to planet Jupiter, the escape velocity would be a much larger number, because it's a much larger planet with much larger gravity. But that's basically the answer to Natalie's question. We don't hold something down completely if it's going fast enough, and fast enough means greater than 25,000 miles an hour going upward.